uh, uh, encounters, you know, just roll up monsters and fight them. If you guys want to do that, uh, we will. Sounds good. Yep. All right. I know you guys want to roll some dice, man. <laughs> Which one you want to play sooner? You I'm probably going to play um, Skinny Mac. No, I'm probably going to play Skinny Mac. <laughs> you guys going to do Tier 2? Okay. So for those of you in the channel watching uh, who are interested in getting in games in the future, uh, just kind of watch how this is done and learn a little bit about Fantasy Grounds. And if you want to, you can go to the YouTube channel and check out the videos there. And we got a couple, couple three guys were asking me about it. And uh, I think what I'm going to do is new people that have never, ever used Fantasy Grounds, I'm going to have them watch a couple times before they just jump in, you know. That works. You know, unless yeah, they're... I think, I think I watched uh, various YouTube or uh, Twitch chat channels for roughly a year before I finally jumped into fantasy. Oh, really? <laughs> uh, a year, I, I don't think I would ask somebody to do, but... Uh, yeah, it that's, was a little excessive. That's thorough. That's thorough is what that is. Uh, what's skinny? Is he paladin? Yes, sir. Five paladin, one fighter. All right. Okay, so we're going to use Benkel and Skinny. Uh, so that's level 6 and level 6. Oh, snap. Alright, let's do this. We're going to go through some shit today. Let's get out a... Uh... This might be tough. You know, the, uh, the encounter builder... Only does parties of three through seven. So I have to put in level six party of three, and then you guys have to deal with it. Oh, that's possible. We're probably good. Sooner you've been squatting long enough, haven't you? No. Nope. <laughs> My squatting has uh, fallen off. You curtailed your squatting? Yeah. No, it's uh, my laptop isn't so happy, so lots of times it won't reload the page oh, or like sure. Rob's stream when it uh, when he goes to a VOD or something like that. Oh, it shuts off, and then you it, you have to reload it to get back in. Yeah, I gotta refresh the page for it to keep watching. So my squatting hasn't uh, helped me out very much lately. You gotta actively squat. I'm playing like 10 other games. <laughs> I know. I don't hold still very so, well. So, Rob, I've got, uh, I'll, I'll talk to you after if you want, but I've got a couple of adventures, but they are definitely uh, higher level tier two. Okay. Uh, the problem would be uh, I know. getting yeah. getting enough, yeah, getting enough people. I mean, there's plenty of the people that have tier two, but... Can you get them all there? I mean, you only need three, and I'll be one, so you'll really only need two players. Well, I'll be there. Yeah, so we just need, uh, and I'm sure... I've got a, uh, a tier one that I can run through. It'll probably take anywhere between three and four sessions. Gotta okay, get all these yeah, great. Oh, runtime exception, bad allocation. Oh, really? Fancy grounds crashed immediately. Oh no! Well, did yours, Joe? Nope. Do you got right, the map? I'm, yep. I'm gonna restart. Okay. And I'll be back because this happened last time and it fucked me up real bad. If when I just reloaded, I'll be right back though. No, one of those overland maps. It is, yeah. And I, I already, even though we've only looked at one of them, this is the second one, and I already emailed the guy and said. You know, hey, man, these don't... And see, he's not a Fantasy Grounds user, so I told him... I said, you know what you need to do? You need to download Fantasy Grounds, familiarize yourself with it. I mean, if you're going to be selling these maps to people for such an express purpose, you need to see what happens. Yeah. And you need to open a map in Fantasy Grounds, and you need to put a grid on it, and you need to look and see what it looks like, and ask yourself, like, what the hell, you know? And he did yeah, say he's going to try to... 
he's going to try to soften the contrasts and do another do another stuff but he really appreciated our comments because it's a kickstarter and once he sends out the maps you know you don't want pissed off people all right yeah I, and i i did i i blindly did the between being too harsh and <clears throat> yeah and i blindly did the whole entire kickstarter I, with all his levels and everything for like 85 bucks so I want to make sure. Good. Yeah, it better be good. <laughs> All right, let's see what this monster does to kick these guys' ass. Oh, snap. What in the fuck? Does that thing even have a head? That is fucking nasty looking. Hate humanoids. <laughs> That's good. Dangerous blood. Their blood is poisonous and corrosive, and most creatures are native to the material plane. The folk of the Lang Prize is making them ethnic harpoons and enchanted nets. Oh my god. So this thing's. <clears throat> it's got shield, silence, arcane eye, confusion, hypnotic pattern, and stone skin. Poisonous blood. When the spiderling casts its shield, it can also make a shocking grasp attack. Oh my god. Two claw attacks, two staff attacks, or one of each. Oh, this thing is fucking nasty. They are gonna fucking enjoy this. Oh yeah, this thing's nasty. <laughs> You like that map, Baboonski? Uh, yeah, this is part of a Kickstarter. Uh, the Kickstarter is RPG Wilderness Maps. Uh, you can go look it up right now. It's still going. And I don't, I don't enjoy the, the blurry sort of blurriness about it. If he, but he, he, uh, he specifically is making the maps to look painted. You know, so that it looks like you painted something. And uh, it does look pretty cool, but in Fantasy Grounds, you know, you can see how it kind of would get kind of crazy. But there, there is a few of these maps. Uh, I'll show you a couple more here. Here's Tropical Shores, which that one doesn't look too bad. That one looks like it could be pretty useful. Tropical Shores. Uh, let's see. Wil uh, Wil Wildwood Hills. Again, not too bad, but the yeah, the trees, the way they look with their painted look. I don't know if I it's kind of distracting to the eye, so hopefully rural farmland is one. Uh this is the one we used the first time when we played, which was kind of there's even some still tokens right there. But it, you know, it kind of you're looking at it and you're like, "Oh, Jesus Christ." So they are really cool looking. Here's high peaks. They are cool looking, but uh, he gave me about 10 of them. Uh, I only have 8 in here because 2 of them didn't come through right when he emailed me. But uh, there's hundreds of maps. So if yeah, if, you, if anybody's interested in his Kickstarter, you can go check it out. RPG Wilderness Maps. I, I, I kickstarted the whole $85 package, but I think he's got stuff for even like you know 10 bucks or whatever. You guys can check it out if you're interested in maps. But I am working with him to get those more clear and less contrasty uh so that when you use them in fantasy grounds they're better because i'm here to help i'm here to give suggestions uh yeah and they are pretty high res but he they're, they're not low res he he did that on purpose he he used the blur effect because he thought it looked cool and it does look cool but you know because he wanted to look like you painted it with your with paint brushes but in Fantasy Grounds, it's like, no, man, just do the clear, you know, so I got to tell him. Uh, where did you get the spider tool that looks fucking killer? Oh, the spider? The spider I got, I rolled off, uh, well, here, let me, let me, uh, I'll find out what it's from. Hold on. Spider of Lang. That's from Tome of Beasts. Uh, so, it, yeah, that's a monster that, that's in the Tome of Beasts. 
I've never seen it before. It's fucking awesome. Today's the first day I've ever even seen it. I have uh, I have Tome of Beasts. I have the book sitting right over there. And I also have it on Fancy Grounds, but I've never... You know, I'm not one of these people that when I get a Monster Manual, I read it cover to cover like these crazy people. First of all, because if I ever play, I don't really want to know. I don't... I like to have the book, but I don't like to learn it because... As a DM, I'm pretty proficient in quickly reading and knowing what I got to do with it. But as a player, I, I don't want to have any information, right? I, I just don't want to know. Where's Stoon? Are you still gone? I think so. Are you listening to me blab to the stream, or you have that off? No, oh, I've got it muted. Oh, okay. We're talking about the monster you're going to fight. Because <laughs> they see a picture oh. of it. Yeah. <laughs> Sooner says he's all moat back. So all almost right. without an S. All right, what happened? There was a lot of dead air there. I was reading and doing stuff. We're waiting for Sooner to get back connected. Uh, yeah, I think you're right, Babunski. I think the trees is what fucks it up. Because um, you see, like, looking at this map, if the trees were, were sharper and clearer, you would really enjoy this a lot, you know? But see, when you zoom in, you get this fucking... looks. It just looks like crap. Maybe what I'll do is I'll spend 10 minutes making a video and post it to YouTube as a private thing and then give that guy the link and say, hey, go watch this video I made. All right. I don't know what's going on with my fantasy grounds lately, but it's crashing like all the time when I'm on someone else's table. Yeah, and the thing is that could be it could be like 100 different reasons why that's happening. Yeah, it would be nice to build in an error log, but maybe it's somewhere. I just uh, they it. they actually do have an error log, but nobody knows how to fucking read. <laughs> oh. There there is an error log, but I looked at it one time and I was like, oh my god, I wouldn't have the fucking slightest clue because all it is yeah, is a C++. it's a bunch of shit. You know the stuff when it pops up in the upper left window and the and it gives you like yeah. a white box. It's all just that shit, and you're like, oh fuck, I don't know what this is. You can't source it out, yeah. You know? That would be nice. But usually you can just go on the forums and get a hold of Trenlo or Damned or Zacchaeus or one of those guys. And, and, they, and they go, oh, yeah, yeah, this is what it is. Fix this. But usually everyone's answer is empty your cache. And then if it keeps happening, reinstall Fantasy Grounds. Yeah. Well, it's like runtime errors. Maybe there's a runtime compatibility yeah. issue or... You know, you don't have the the latest version, or uh, yeah, it could be fucking any number of shit. All right, roll initiative, you fuckers. I'm just gonna have you. We're not. It's not time yet, but oh yeah, oh my god, the sounds. Everything works today. Uh, okay, so you guys are walking along. Let me give Stuner the map here. So you guys are walking along uh, this path. And there's some foresty areas to your left and some hill, like a little hill to your right. And so you guys are, I don't know if I've locked the tokens or not. 
There you go. You guys are free to move your tokens. You don't see any monsters yet. Oh, wow. I didn't go to the edge of the map. I kind of put you guys in a little bit. <laughs> That's all right. Yeah, so I think we just continue walking side by side. Yeah, absolutely. Just chit-chatting, going down. Chit-chatting, going down. I don't know, imagine we're heading back to the guild or something. I don't know. All right, and yeah, right about then... Uh, okay. this thing comes crawling down off the mountain here. And look at this fucking thing. That is fucking nasty. I don't even know. Where's the head? Like, is there a head? I don't know. It's underneath the one of the 17 arms. I see. Yeah. Big, 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 big fangs. Yeah. So, Banco, you see this thing. Uh, and before it does anything, you have a chance to act. Uh, yeah, it's a holy motherfucker. Um, yuck. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'll, sh I'll, sh I'll shoot a crossbow at it. Okay. <laughs> yuck. That's funny. I haven't heard that for a long time. Need a second one of... The outcropping behind them to box them. In. Yeah, this is yeah, a fucking tough range, monster, though. though. Two of them would fucking kill these guys. For sure. All right. You shoot a crossbow at it and miss. Oh, no. Yeah. I'm going to take a step back to just try and be safe with Sooner. All right. So this thing... is going to choose a target which is going to be Stooner so Skinny Mac and it is going to spit venom of course it is and it spits venom and you see it fly by in a globule form much like a loogie and it is disgusting and gross and uh, you have Manage to not get hit with it. And now it is Sir Skinny Mac. Definitely moving forward. All right. Um, main action, Conjure Duplicate for my Channel Divinity. Bonus action, Poison My Blade. So I'll need a copy of myself, please, sir. Okay. Right there. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. Let's get an S token. S, 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 S. Man, I got a shit ton of tokens. There is a lot of tokens in here. All right. And do you do anything else? I do not, sir. All right. Sorry, it's All right. been a week since I played, you know. I don't have these fantasy grounds anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Bankle. I'll make some comment to myself about, oh, shit, we're really doing this as he's rushing in. <laughs> I'm he's spitting just... fucking acid at me. I got to get closer to him to kill him. Yeah, no, I'm with you, man. But yuck. All right. Uh, I'll come into here and... I'm going to spiritual weapon just right off the bat and get this thing going. Okay. Uh, within 60 feet, so we'll put it. The... And it'll attack right away. Okay. It hits. And it does 10 damage. Keep clicking wrong buttons here, sorry. And then, um, 
bonus, that was bonus action. So for my full action, I will crossbow again. Okay. Oh, snap. There's no effect. You may roll nice. your crit damage. All right. You do 11 crossbow damage. 11 I'll piercing. I'll because I don't think I've ever hit anything with that thing. And, <laughs> and then you critted. All right. This thing... Right there. And then what's the deal with the duplicate? Is it a... I forget how that works. It's basically just looks exactly like me, and if it's standing right beside me, I have advantage on my attacks. So it attacks... It's, it just decides, like, I roll a dice and pick... I'm attacking the fake one or you. Is that how that works? Yeah, that's totally up to you. Um, the fake one doesn't take damage, right? So, But if I hit it, what happens to it? God damn thing. <laughs> you realize that it's a... a, a, a it realizes it's fake. Okay. Uh, so he's gonna he's gonna choose a target, which is going to be the top guy. So that's really you. And then he's going to two claw or two staffs or one of each. All right, so he's gonna do a claw, which hits. Damn. And does some poison and slashing damage to you. And then he's going to use his staff. And his staff misses. And so he is done. And Skinny Mac. I'm going to swing away. And if I hit, I would like to use Divine Smite. And I also poison my blade. Okay. And this thing's a dragon, right? <laughs> yeah, it, it, it's a it's a spider dragon. Just in case. Is that a hit, sir? Uh, it is a hit. Let me apply my five thousand paladin effects, Baboonski was right. I should have had another one of these come up behind you guys. <laughs> I don't like him. <laughs> yeah, he's <laughs> trying to kill you guys. Oh, shit. You do 48 damage. I'll leave my turn, sir. Uh, 35 of that was what went through to it, so it resisted something. Probably my poison, maybe? No. Maybe. I don't know. I'm all right with that. All right. Uh, Bankle. Uh, I'll move my spiritual weapon up 20 so I can get a little closer. I don't have a lot of good options here, Stuner. I'm going to cast Command. Feel the burn of Spider of Lang. <laughs> You're going to cast command. Okay. We'll see if this works first. He fails. He will have command drop. No, command flee. He will move away as fast as possible for one round. Okay. That'll be it for me. So, sooner you may take an op shot. Absolutely. And you hit. And you do 10 damage with your battle axe of Dragon Slayer. Yeah, best battle axe in the game. And now it is your turn. Well, he moved too fucking far away. Well, that's, that's not that's not my fault. <laughs> sure. I thought about that after. So yeah. that's a okay. It's a okay. 
I'm going to touch myself and lay on hands myself. Okay. And that will be my turn, sir. All right, Benko. I'm gonna try that crossbow again. Within seventy-five. All right. And this time you miss. All right. Back in business. This thing. Uh. What does this do? You create invisible. Yeah, I don't care about that. All right. Uh, he's going to move. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, he's going to move, but he's only going to move to there. Then he's going to roll for a target. And he has chosen the fake thing. So he spits at the fake thing. Uh, fake at, at fake skinny. And let's see. It's got all your same stats and all that stuff. It's just the exact replica of me. I'll read it. Give me a second. Uh, you create a visual illusion of yourself to last for one minute or until you lose concentration. The illusion appears in an unoccupied space of your choice that you can see within 30 feet of you. looks exactly like me. It is silent. It is my size. It is insubstantial and does not occupy its space and is unaffected by attacks and damage. Oh, so... Spells through it. But the, the, it's insubstantial, and can you post that? Oh, yeah, here it is. It's the first one. Can yeah, it, it is. I'm trying to read that again. It looks exactly like you. It is silent. It is your size. It is insubstantial, which means it... This thing can tell it's not a real thing. I mean, is that because I, I, you know, like um, the wizard spell um, mirror image? It's like roll, that's roll a wisdom rule. Yeah, like that, that that's designed to make it so that the monster can't tell the difference at all between the four things that are there. But this is just a kind of an aid for you that gives you advantage and this and that. But I don't think it's supposed. I don't think it tricks people into thinking that it's actually another copy of you. I don't. I don't know. I don't, it doesn't really clarify that. But it does it say does that not. it's insubstantial. As a bonus action, you can move it. So basically, it allows you to get advantage. It allows you to cast spells through it. Yeah. If. Uh, me and the illusion are within five feet of a creature that can see the illusion. Right. Advantages on attack rolls. Given how uncanny the illusion is, is what it says. Right. But the it doesn't... I, I would think that... I mean, I'm going to say that... I mean, I already did it the first time. I, I Well, no, I shot at you anyway. But yeah, I'm going to say that since it's not affected by attacks, that it doesn't get attacked. All right, so, that's fine with me. So he's going to spit at you. Uh... Yeah, And he hits. So you take some poison damage. And you make the save, which saves you from whatever the hell else is going to happen to you. Who knows? Skinny Mac. Both me and my illusion are moving up 30 feet, sir. Okay. Trying to find a square. All right. And I'm going to cast. No, I can't do that. Can't do that one either. 
Because having that guy out is a concentration thing. I, I will have to fix that later. Oh, it is a concentration? Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll just uh, ready attack if it gets within melee range and I'll be all. Okay. Uh, Banco. Want to move up 10 feet? And cast command again. <laughs> okay. He succeeds. Wait 30 seconds. Be nice. Uh, all right. He is going to... Try that shit again. Oh. Is it like Dragon's Breath where it has to regenerate? <laughs> I all of a sudden don't remember how to draw a fucking... Okay, here we go. Oh, perfect. He is going to do a little something to you guys. Called Make a Save. And one of you succeeds and one of you fails. That was Hypnotic Pattern and Bankel is incapacitated. Shit. Uh... You need to do a wisdom saving throw to get out of that, and you can do that at the end of your turns. Okay. And that is all he's going to do. Oh, wait, no, it isn't. That is all he's going to do. All right, Skinny Mac. I'm not liking this guy. So I'm going to try and chase him down. All right. Come closer, he says. <laughs> he doesn't speak. He has no language. Yeah, I'm running right up to him. But my uh, duplicate can only move. Actually, I'm just going to drop my concentration on that duplicate. Okay. And you can dash to there? Yeah, I'm not going to dash to there, and that'll be my turn, sir. All right. Uh, Banco so may make your save. Gone. Yeah, wisdom Wait, save. Wisdom save, right? Yeah. You're looking for a 14, and you get a 26. So you are no longer <laughs> incapacitated. But that is the end of my turn, you said, right? That's the end of your turn, yeah. All right. Uh, Spider of Lang. Time to put the hammer down. Going to do a little claw action. And hit. Going to do a little staff action. Oh, snap. That's a hit. You're attacking the wrong person, sir. What? Th that's why. Yep. Oh, fuck. So, unless any of those are 24s, they don't hit. <laughs> so, let me go back and give Banko his... <laughs> Jesus Christ. 17 and... Welcome back, man. Welcome back. 12. Yeah, I know, right? So Banco goes from 29 damage to 0 damage. Uh, let's see. The hits were not a 24. And not a 24. Your, your AC is 24. Yes, sir. Fucking okay. A. You know we're going to get like worst things thrown at us saying yeah you're gonna make me start breaking out spells now if i can't hit you <laughs> okay skinny mac uh do, right. uh uh if you hit do not do damage okay um bonus action shield of faith on myself okay 
and then I'm going to swing. Okay. That doesn't sound good. Uh, okay, so that's a hit, but wait a minute. Let me uh, let me do something. Uh, no, you may go ahead and do your damage. Sir. Sure. Because you can't shield that. And you do 10 damage. That'll be my turn. All right, Benko. I'll move up 15. Oh, I need to move up more. 10 more, I guess. Okay. And I'm really wanting this thing to actually work again, so I'm going to try command. Okay. He succeeds. You fucker. <laughs> and by the Who way, he got a weapon he rolled a uh, he rolled a 15 exactly is what he rolled, <laughs> which is what he needed. All right, spider action. I did move my spiritual weapon on that turn. Oh yeah, that's fine. I'll move it. Uh All right. Make sure I get the right target this time. Jesus Christ. He is going to do a little wavy wavy of some of those arms. And tries to cast a spell on Skinny, who decides that for his saving throw, he's going to roll a 20 plus 2. So that doesn't work. And you can you could swear that even though the spider thing doesn't speak, you can hear him say cock hunt. You you swear you hear that. I have a question though. How yeah. the fuck did I roll a plus two? Uh skinny wisdom save plus two. My wisdom oh my save is I have proficiency in saves. Here. Yeah. I was like, my wisdom's minus one. How the fuck am I getting any of that? But you have a plus three proficiency, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so that's why. All right. Uh, so it's skinny man. All right. I'm going to swing away. And if I hit, I'd like to use first level divine smite this time. Okay. So. Uh, fuck. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You can go ahead and do your damage. Yes, sir. Uh, you do 22 damage. And I'll take my second swing at him, because I forgot that I have two attacks. Okay. <laughs> Being level 5 and all. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, he is going to prevent that attack. That was a hit, okay. but he's going to shield that. Okay. And let me... So his AC is 14, metagame, metagame. And part of his thing is when he enacts shield, he also gets a free shocking grasp. Okay. And he does that and misses. And once right. again, you think you hear cock hunt. <laughs> All right. Well, that was the end of my turn. So whoever goes after me. Okay, so let me just check one thing real quick before we continue. I heard a special little noise, and I have to find out what it is. Somebody in the chat did something. Let's find out. Redemptions. Critical hit for Skinny Dude. All right, we'll we'll give it to him. 
All right, we're back in business. So that was the end of your turn. And so now it is Benkel. I'm getting mad. Uh, I'm going to try this uh, command thing again one last time. Okay. <laughs> Blowing all your commands. Uh, he succeeds. <laughs> How the f... He's got... Okay, fuck it. <laughs> he rolled a 19 he that time. He has like, like a... a 70% chance of failing and has done it successfully. Three and he has no modifier on that, so it is it is just a straight die roll with no modifier. Just, just that I suck. <laughs> so, DM um, dice mods. That's what it is. DM dice mod. Well, I completely fucked this whole thing up, so there we go. Alright. Uh... He is once again going to try... Well, fuck me. All right, he tries to do something to Skinny, and it does not work. So, uh, Skinny, before you take your turn, stand by. I want to read something real quick, because you have a special circumstance. Oh, God damn it. Who's trolling me now? It's probably me. Oh, all right. Well, I love you all. Because I didn't make him run away, you know, just to come back. Yeah, that's all right. I'm in a good mood today, so I won't get grumpy of old people trolling me. Okay, what would you like to do on this turn? Well, I'm obviously just going to keep swinging like I always do. Okay, in that case, uh, Jimmy Needless K has made this next attack a crit. Ooh. So just roll, hold shift and roll so, damage then? The um, no, don't do damage yet because what we have to do first is you need to roll a d6 to see if the table goes off. Oh, it didn't roll? No, it didn't roll. Okay, so yeah, there's no crit. So, I mean, there's no effect. So yes, just hold shift and roll damage. Very good. He takes 12. And then my second attack, please, sir. Okay. Uh, One moment. Oh, Tigers. Okay, so, yeah, fucking... Yeah, okay, roll damage. God damn it. And you do eight more. And that will be my turn, sir. So. All right, Benkel. I don't like him. I was going to run up. Semi-spiritual weapon. All right. I'll have my spiritual weapon attack. Okay. Spiritual weapon misses. And I'll swing as well. Uh, your Warhammer does hit. And you do 10 damage right. and place him into now critical doing... status. All right. Thank you for doing now he's got two of you in his face. Oh man, he's fucking hell bent on skinny. All right, he's gonna try this fucking thing again. He must be successful. Uh, yeah, that's what I said. Yeah. Oh my god! Fuck! All right, so nothing happens on his turn. Skinny back. Alright, so we're gonna wait twice, sir. Alright. That's a hit. You do min damage. Yeah. That one is he's gonna shield. Yes, sir. And because of that. He's going to do his free Uchimawaki. What did I say it was? Oh, uh, shocking, grasp. shocking grasp. Yeah. And he misses. All right. Hey. And that'll be the end of my turn, sir. 
Okay, Benkel. So I'm just going to try and hit him. Okay. Me and the spiritual weapon. That won't do it. It took shield off. It should still be on there. Yeah, it should. That's a hit anyway. Yeah, I wonder why it took it off. That's weird. Uh, you do five damage. And now he is going to simply... Try to attack Bengal. Claw. It's a crit. Crit fumble? No, it's a crit crit. I have an idea not. Yeah, yeah. You don't extra die of psychic damage to the try. enemy after your attack. It's worth a shot. Appreciate it. Okay, so you take that crit damage. If it's a poison save, I have advantage. Okay. Uh, also, it was a it was a particularly hateful attack, so you will take an extra d10 of psychic, of which that is five. And then he will do his second attack, which will be the staff. And he hits you with the staff. Doing some poison damage, which you partially resist. And you fail your save twice, because I, I rolled it for twice for advantage. Meaning that you are poisoned and blinded for one round. Skinny man. Uh, Take him out. Yeah. I'm going to swing at him twice. That's a miss. And That's a oh. miss. <laughs> oh, shit. Banco is poisoned and blinded, but you can still do stuff. Yeah, I'll level three cure wounds myself. Okay. I gotta double check something. There was some healer feat that I got. Isn't if you cure other people, you can cure yourself as well. Yeah. Hey, Ting Jong, when you do loot, you help. need to do uh, exclamation loot space and then the number you want to bet. There it is. Blast healer. Six <laughs> Skeeter M is in the chat. God damn it. <laughs> Gotta have oh, it, yeah, restores hit points other than mine. Okay, so just just me, level three cure wounds. Gotta get that sixty thousand XP on two characters. Yeah, yeah. I'll pick myself up a little bit. All right, you heal up nineteen. And then being blinded, can I have can my spiritual weapon attack? Or I mean, I imagine I would need to see. Uh, I used to that think, be a yeah, no, somebody said to me, cause uh, my, my thing and we were playing Curse of Strahd and somebody had a spiritual weapon, but then they went around a corner and, uh, I said, well, wouldn't you need to see your spiritual weapon to be able to use it? And someone presented to me the idea, well, it's magical. And I was like, yeah, okay. <laughs> and it doesn't say that. It doesn't say you need to see it. So yeah, I say you can attack with it. Okay. So no disadvantage on this one? No, just regular. Should I click advantage? Because it'll automatically do disadvantage, right? Oh, yeah, because it's treating it like it's you, right? Yeah, so do click advantage then. Okay. And oh. you fumbled. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, you got more than a bargain. Roll twice on this table and choose one. Uh, at least, you, at least, weapon? at All least right. you get to choose. Oh yeah, you still get the fucking table. So let me get the table here. Uh, man, I'm really sucking hind tit in this one, man. I'm even right, pretty right. useless. So I'm gonna roll, it and then uh, you can choose. So you get 
those two to choose from. Uh, pushed, yeah. Okay. Uh, good enough. Oh, I figured it would push my spiritual weapon. Okay, never mind. Oh, you know what? That's, that's you know, that's a good point, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. And uh, then I'm done. Yeah, yeah, that's, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, my God. What's going on? <laughs> why is, why did we hear that noise again? Oh, because it expired off of you. All right. So the spider is going to claw again. And miss. And it's going to use its staff and miss. So that was completely ineffective. Sir Skinny Mac. Swinging for the fences. God damn it. <laughs> and that is another miss, I'm assuming, yes? That is a miss. That Ouch. is a hit, yeah. Get him, Mac, get him. All right, you Make did five damage. damage. Minimum damage. And that'll be my turn, sir. All right. Binkle. All right, so I'll move my spiritual weapon to the other side. Maybe I can get him from behind this time. I'll have it uh, attack. All right. Damn it. That's a miss. Piece of shit spiritual weapon. And that's it, though. More hammer. And a d6 damage. Die, spider, die. All right. He decides for whatever reason he is going to try to... swing at Skinny again <clears throat> with his 55 armor class. And he misses with the claw, and he misses with the staff. And skinny. Swinging away, sir. Miss. Oh, I thought that was a one. I was like, Jesus Christ. All right, and I'll swing away again. That's a hit. That's a shield, is it not? No. he's oh, he, okay. His AC is <laughs> 20, so he can't shield that. Or, I mean, it would be 20 if he shielded. Oh, okay. Uh, yep, you do 11 damage. And Banko. I'm going to try uh, level 2 Inflict Wounds. Oh, I like it. I'll reach, I'll reach, out, and reach out and see if I can grab a, a hand. You do hit... And you inflict death. God damn. Good. Very nice. Uh oh, take what a breather after that one. What happened to my encounter? What's going on here? Oh, I bet I, I bet it's behind the map. Yes, it is. All right. Ooh. Uh, recover crossbow bolts. One, two, three, four, five. Hey, Chartholomew, Char Chartholomew, oh my god, I, I screwed up that name. What, uh, yeah, yeah, you can totally do it. Welcome to the channel, thanks for the follow. And you guys will get some XP. This, you roll, uh... You roll however many you shot and take that, right? You, yeah, you, you take, um, half or what you roll, whichever's higher. All right. All right, you guys just got fourteen fifty apiece. Jesus, that's pretty good. I only need two k more. Yeah. All right. Let's go again. Let's fight something else. Do we get a short rest in the meantime, or no? <laughs> uh, yeah, both of you guys roll a d20. Yeah, 
Yes, you do get a short rest. So you may throw hit die if you'd like. Fuck you, min rolls. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. Back to being healthy. All right. And let's get a another one of these fantastic maps to look at. that uh, duplicate concentration thing on them. So. Oh, yeah. We got to get that off. So everybody else should be good, yeah? Okay. Uh, let's do... I know, this will be fun. Let's do this one. So you guys decide... You, you, you come upon a, a beach. You, you, you aren't able to understand how because you're not near an ocean, but maybe this is a little lake or something. And you're maybe hanging out on the beach. And just as you are from the other side, you see some fucking what the fuck coming at you. And you have evidently oh, wow. encroached on their territory. And you can roll initiative. Fuck, I'm pulling some honey I shrunk the kid shit. We could run away. Whoops, I rolled twice. And damn it. I want my first one too. Uh to penalize a stooner, we will give him his current initiative. Yeah, that's acceptable. <laughs> I like that rule personally. If you fuck up your rolls, too. Yeah, bad. you know, fuck up, you fucking take it. All right, so the first one to act is one of these things who's coming at you. Am I not seeing? Are we not on the map? Oh, we're, uh, we're just way over to the right. Never mind. Yeah, just... yeah, way, yeah, the right. So. Oh, I didn't lock the tokens. There we go. I just put it in squares. So this guy moves there. And that's all he does. Skinny Mac. Um, I'm going to start chanting. Okay. Uh, six fighter every arms extra attack every time I take the attack option or use the attack option. And I will move up just a little bit to there. And Not a full turn. charge? I like it. Yep. <laughs> Not a full charge this time. There's more than one. And that will be my turn. Yes. Thank you. All right, that guy moves to there. And Banko. I'm doing janky. Just a second. I'm going to come down to the other side of this thing here, and I'll cast Spirit Guardians. Okay. Let me just find the radius on this again for a second. Oh my god, look in the chat. That is unbelievable. I was I was putting in a loot amount as a joke and I just started punching keys randomly and it <laughs> the, the first one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
That's amazing. Because I just took my fingers and just like pounded on the keys. That What are the chances of that? Pretty slim, I'd say. Yeah, right? All right. And then is that a thing where if they're in it or if they, they move in it or whatever the fuck? If they, if they move in it or start their turn in it. Okay. And that will be it for me. Um, that was my action. Yeah, that'll be it. All right. So this guy here is coming in. So whatever happens to him. Okay. I, uh, speed is halved in the area. I think you can still make it in, but he makes a wisdom saving throw on a failed save, takes damage on a, on a success. He takes half. Okay, go for it. To have that on myself. Uh, he succeeds, so he's going to take half. Yeah, yeah, I, I fully understand. Uh, okay, so then he's going to attack Benkel. And he is going to use his long sword and hit. What is the difference here? Oh, right, okay. And he's going to do... Uh... 11 damage, and then... Is that thing you have on a concentration? Yep. Okay, well, you, you passed your uh, thing, so he did not dispel it. He is then going to use his tail to try to sting you. And he misses. Skinny Mac. All right, I'm going to move in. All right. Uh, I'm going to move to there. And I'm going to take my three swings at this guy. All right. You have got a critical hit. And let's see. <laughs> Fucking A. All right. Uh, go ahead and roll your damage. All right, you do 14, and then your effect is turn your head and cough. You literally turn your head and cough and breathe a 30-foot cone of random damage type where it will cover the most of your enemies. <laughs> wow. So let's just say that... Um, let's just say that you do that to the guy on top, because you can only really get one. That's acceptable. And the damage type, I need to find out what it is. Well, hold on a second. Are they immune? That's the thing. Okay, it won't matter what the damage type is because they don't have any resistances or anything. So we'll just do... Uh, the damage is going to be... Oh, it's a... De it's a dex... Okay, so it's a dex save. And let's do that. And he failed, so he's going to take the full amount of damage, which I believe is 18, yes? Yes, sir. Alright. So he's going to take 18. What a punk. Not bad for my first of three attacks, eh? Right? Yeah. Alright. Continue. I will. Thank you. Turn your head and cough. That is it. You do nine more. My last attack is a miss. It is a miss. All right. Uh, well, he certainly didn't appreciate that one iota. But first, he's going to take some kind of fucking crap. 
he fails and takes the full brunt of, oh my god, like 18 damage. Mushroom, you gotta get racing and crush Nesh Nabaspa. Yeah? Remember? He's gonna swing his sword. And miss, he is going to try to sting you with his tail. And miss, he is going to disappointingly pass his turn to Banco. I'm going to try to inflict wounds again on this guy. All right. Level two. Is all like, I've, yeah, it's, I've burned through all my ones. You have hit him? And inflicted 15 damage. And now he will take more damage. From your... Wow, took 18. He is going to try to use his longsword again. Against Bankle. And miss. And now try to sting him. And miss, because they suck. And it's now Sir Skinny. I'm going to take my three swings at this guy, please. Miss number one. Miss number two. Hit. Sweet. One for three. Well done. <laughs> yeah, and that'll be my turn, sir. Yeah, we'll see if he can get one for three. Well, he only gets two. All right, so he's going to swing his... Uh... Oh, I gave him that save. Sorry. Oh, yeah, thank you. Yeah, you can give him the damage, too. I forgot about that. All right, still alive. <laughs> and he, of course, just fucking swings wildly. Bankle. Uh, swinging Warhammer. That's a hit. Round four. Damage to the thing. All right. <laughs> That's so funny. He swings his longsword and misses. He swings his tail and fumbles. Fucking A, man. Fucking A, indeed. I like that. Uh, he got an effect that won't affect him, but uh, it was a fumble. Fuck. All right, Skinny. Yes, sir. You know it. You know the deal. Three misses. Oh, that's a hit. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, snap. He goes away. And so I'll you turn can, on the other guy with you can two. turn your attentions to elsewhere. Uh, yes, that is a miss. And my last attack is a hit. Woot. As per the swoosh sound or the clank sound, uh, you do eight damage. And that'll be my turn, sir. All right, he's going to take damage from Bankle's spell. And he fails and takes all of this 19 damage. And he is going to come up here after he's figured out after four rounds what the hell's going on. He's going to try the sting first and miss the longsword. And hit. Bankle takes some damage and he fails his concentration save. But it is now Bankle's turn. I will the Warhammer. Alright. And you hit. 
And you kill him. <laughs> ah, fuck. And I come at murder. Alright, so you guys, uh... You guys put down your beach intrusion, or your beach interrupt, and I mean. And you will now get XP, but just how much okay. XP will it be? Use my last spell slot and cure myself. Okay. Yeah. And I'll lay out my beach towel and take a... Get some, get some sun. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> we go kill a rabbit. A skinny, a skinny Mac needs like a fucking <laughs> a rabbit. Yeah, he needs to kill a rabbit. Yeah. Um. And let's just see. These were semi-intelligent creatures. I wonder if there's any loot. Yeah, last one even had arms. Fucking spider with arms. And you guys are relaxing on the beach. Goddamn. And this thing comes out of the water. Yeah, you might not want to stand by that thing, sir. Yeah, he's got a... I wonder if he killed that thing that's on his skull or if that's part of him. It's like a hermit crab where he just stole it, you think? Just to look like a badass? I hope it's because he killed something. Because that's a way cooler story. And he comes out and surprises you guys and attacks Benkel. And I'm assuming that was long. It took longer than one minute to happen. Yes. Yeah, you guys. Uh, well, you laid down on your beach towel, and then, and then yeah, yeah. So, so any, any of that attack. stuff, yeah, you got to remove that. And he claws twice at Banco, hitting him once. And you guys can roll initiative. Yes, sir. I disengage. Okay. I might go one more, and that'll be okay. It. All right. So the bone crab comes up to Skinny Mac, and even though you said you'd lay down on your towel, I'm not going to make you prone. <laughs> oh, that's all right. You could if you wanted. I wouldn't. <laughs> it's my own stupidity, right? Let's see. He is just going to try to claw you. And misses twice. Ask for a rabbit, get a crab. Uh, so skinny Mac. I'm going to swing at him twice. Okay. Yes, that is a hit. What's up, Gwydion? And my second attack. Yeah, crits all day. Let's boys. see. You're trying to get rid of Oh, my God. Okay, go ahead and do your damage. <laughs> I like it when the DM says that type of stuff. Like, this is bullshit. Yeah. So then the, the crit effect was unintentional move. Your, tar your target moves at 10 feet in a random available direction, provoking opportunity attacks. Motherfucker. All right. Well, I'm going to definitely take that opportunity attack. All right. And it's and a miss. miss. And that will be my turn, sir. All right. Uh, so, Bankle. Uh, I'm going to Sacred Flame. He succeeds. And I'll come over here. This thing's going to rush right back. As a matter of fact, it leaps. It leaps to that position. Strong legs on that motherfucker to jump out of water. And fucking misses twice. <laughs> okay. Uh, skinny Mac. Swinging away, sir. Miss. And miss. 
Oh, oh crit miss. There we go. There's the karma that was coming my way. All right, that wasn't as bad as it could have been. And that will be my turn, sir. All right, Benko. Mm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Wait, can I stowing my shield, or do I need to drop it? Stowing would be an action, right? Uh, you. you what are you holding now? Or is that an interaction? A uh, shield and a warhammer. Yeah, so you can you can stow one free. As a you free? Can, okay. Yeah. That's what I'll do. I'll stow my, my shield and run up two-handing the warhammer. Okay, so make sure and take your shield AC off. Yep. All right. Then you got, um, come up there and swing two-handed and hit. Oh, and you do max damage. Nice. And you feel that it was partially not good. <laughs> you know what I mean. Yeah. So you crack some crap. I, I'm ready for some supper. Rations for. All time. right. And the, he's going to try to claw the unshielded bankle and miss. He's going to try to do it again and get the same fucking roll. Unbelievable. Skinny Mac. Swinging away, as per my usual. All right, you hit. And splat goes the crab, everybody. Yay, these things are scary as fuck. Oh, man, I didn't notice. I just went and got some. I just went and quick in the monster manual and got... Know. Yeah, not a doubt. It was only 100 XP. Oh, uh, fuck. I didn't even realize. I thought, hey, man, good enough. All right. Uh, we are going to make that worth... Well, fuck, I can't find... What is it? The party sheet I need? Just because I'm feeling generous. I appreciate it. Makes my guy even cooler. I'm going to have so much fun trying to actually kill him when I get over my tier 2. Trying to kill me? Yeah. Skinny. Yeah. Okay. I think Fuck we it. will end it here for today, but we will... Uh, skinny can level his character, <clears throat> and then I'm gonna make some. I'm gonna make a couple PCs for pregens. If you.